Hi, this is the auction executive, and today I'm going to talk about product sourcing. How to find products to sell on eBay, mainly through yard sales and uh, wholesale suppliers. Sourcing stock for selling on eBay can be done in a number of different ways. In this video, I'm going to mention the two most popular ways. But it's important to always be on your toes and watch out for the unexpected bargain as you may even find one in your local mall or on your street. If you're going down the collectibles or the second hand route, then you need to check out all the yard sales, car boot sales and house clearance sales both near and far. You can also buy items on eBay and through the quality of your listings sell them on a much higher price. Craigslist and classified ads in your local newspaper or directories are another valuable source of stock. This is probably one of the easiest and cheapest ways to get started, but it does mean that you need to maintain a constant vigilance in sourcing stock. There are numerous wholesale companies selling every type of product imaginable. There are wholesale directories which you can research online and that will point you in the right direction for good dealers. Always do as much research as possible before making any payment and if possible try to get testimonials or feedback from other satisfied buyers. Check the postal address of the company to make sure that it exists, establish how long they have been in business and ask for a guarantee on their delivery time and make sure that you're aware of their minimum order requirements. Only order a small amount of items the first time you place an order to make sure you're happy with the quality. If you're buying from suppliers outside your country, also look closely at shipping prices and whether you think you may incur any additional costs when the items come through a customs check. Once you've established a relationship, with your wholesaler. You can then buy in larger bulk and may even be able to barter a little or request additional product lines. There is a wealth of ways to source stock to sell on eBay and probably one of the key factors is not to place all your eggs in one basket. Have a range of places you can buy from and use a number of wholesalers and that way if any of your suppliers have delivery problems you have other stock lines to fall back on. The key is to check the stock carefully wherever it is coming from. Quality, value and availability. These are your watchwords and they will take you far. If you don't want to purchase multiple items that you aren't sure you'll be able to resell, then drop shipping can be an option. Drop shipping is when you can list items on your auctions or buy it now listings but only order the item from the drop shipping company when you actually have made a sale. The wholesaler or drop shipper then packages and ships the item directly to your buyer. You therefore never have out of pocket expenses as you don't have to make a purchase until you have received the payment from your buyer. You must however make careful choices with selecting your drop shipper as you need to make sure that it's a quality item and ensure that it's shipped speedily after purchase as it's your feedback and reputation on the line. Always look for drop shippers therefore that offer a guaranteed shipping time which should usually be within 24 to 48 hours. Another thing to remember is that your profit margin won't be as high as selling on wholesale items that you do not get drop shipped. However, this is usually outweighed by the fact that you have no upfront costs and that you are not having to buy or store large amounts of stock, nor do you have to spend precious time packaging items or taking trips to the post office. If you want more product sourcing tips, go to www.auctionexecutive.com. Thank you.